So when you first started in the industry, you had braces. Yeah. <laughs> so did you like really lean into that? I assume that you probably did a lot of teen scenes, right? Yeah. So when I got in, it wasn't ideal. Like originally I wanted to wait until like after I had my braces off until like I got like all the little like work that I wanted. But I was like, you know what? Like I'm going to be making like so much more money so much more quickly um, shooting scenes than stripping and camming. Um, so yeah, I was like, I might as well um, kind of exploit this like fetish that people really like and try to like milk mm -hmm. as much out as I can, like starting looking super young and then, mm -hmm. you know, grow into the performer I wanted to be. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I realized pretty quickly that, again, I wasn't getting the work I wanted because of how I looked. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I had to kind of grow out of that one. But yeah, I was doing a lot of teen, a lot of uh brace face I was getting I was like really like kind of uh what's the word kind of pigeonholed into like the same characters I was always like the naive virgin yeah. who didn't know what she was doing which was yeah. like so the opposite of me like mm -hmm. I'd always been so sexual from a really early age so yeah I just did not like getting uh typecasted like that at all yeah I mean were there any scenes that you were presented with when you were just like this is a little... Yeah, there is one. It's actually, like, quite hilarious. Um, I didn't wasn't very happy about doing it at first, but by the end of the scene, I was like, this is so funny. And I was like, okay, I'm just going to, like, really lean into the comedy of this. Mm -hmm. But um, they wanted me to wear headgear. Oh, no. Yeah, they had this, like, <laughs> fake headgear that, like, wasn't <laughs> attached to my actual braces or anything. <laughs> and I just felt, like, so ugly and I yeah it, by the end of the scene I was like this is the funniest scene I've ever done but I definitely did not feel very uh sexy to say the least. god that is I don't think I've ever seen porn with headgear before mm -hmm. and I feel like I've seen it all yeah my headgear was supposed to get stuck on the kitchen sink and oh you know, it was a stuck scene yes, with headgear and what did my stepbrother do being so helpful I mean he he wouldn't help you like get unstuck no. he has to have sex with you yeah, because the you're only natural solution <laughs> you know the problem solving that we do in porn is just like sometimes really like next yeah. level it's just <laughs> innovative god